Hi, my name is Roger Ahuja, and I'm going to take a couple of minutes and show you how to use System Restore. Now you'll notice up here, I've got VLC Media Player installed, and I've got a picture of a cat. Now what System Restore does is takes your computer back in time to a point um, before you install certain programs without affecting your personal data files. So if I had installed VLC Media Player and realized that, hey, it's causing my system to crash, then I could go back to a point prior to installing that and it'll get rid of it. It'll be as if the system was back before I had installed it. So to start System Restore, you can run it from within Windows, but I always recommend running it um, from the uh, diagnostic menu. So we're going to hit Start and then go up here to the Power button. While you're holding down the Shift key, press the Power button and go to Restart. Now if it works properly, it's going to go into the um, system diagnostic screen. I have seen it where it doesn't work properly, and when it doesn't work properly, you want to try it from the main screen, uh, the, where you first enter your username and password with the same holding down the shift key, and um, you can try restarting it. Uh, sometimes what that does, that actually logs you in, and then when you go to that start menu and hold down the shift key, it'll, um, it'll work at that point. So here we've got um, a couple of different options and what we want to do is we want to go to troubleshoot and then roll back to a previous build and there's refresh your PC here, reset your PC, um, those are for um, uh, completely reinstalling the operating system, I'm not going to touch those right now and under advanced options that's where you have system restore and here um, once system restore loads you uh, log in with your username here and then if there's a password you enter that and then hit continue and now you've got system restore started and we're gonna hit next and here it's gonna show you um, the most recent um, restore point you can click here to show more if you want to um, I'm just gonna select the most recent one here and then I'm going to scan for affected programs and what that's going to show me is what programs are going to be affected and you can see here VLC Media Player which is what I wanted to remove in this particular case is going to be removed um, because we're restoring to a point before that was installed um, so I'm going to select that and hit next and then go ahead and hit finish and then it gives you a warning that don't interrupt it and now we wait Okay, so once System Restore is finished, we can hit Restart here. And once your machine finishes booting up, you can see uh, the image of the cat is still there, but VLC player is no longer there. And uh, that's it.